So this is a sit down video. It's really hot and it's bright outside and of course the sun is reflecting on my oily skin. So hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share with you this new series that I'm going to start on my channel. I'm actually really excited for this. I'm doing a gift set series for the holidays, Christmas time. So basically what I'm going to be doing is if when I get a gift set, I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to unbox it, tell you my opinions, if I have products, what I think marks out of 10 and just review the overall set and go in depth and then maybe in like a month or two, I'll do a roundup and I'll show you guys my favorites or like talk about my favorites or I'll rank them. So today's video, we're going to be talking about the Sephora favorites must have makeup must haves gift set. I just purchased this one from Sephora. It was $48. I purposely got this one because it was the only one where I didn't have any of the products. I'm trying to think which is, there was a travel size one with like a Huda Beauty silk lip balm and it was like $42 and I had like four of the products already and I was like I'm not gonna waste my money on them. first of all the Marc Jacobs mascara is what I really was attracted to this gift set for it's got I think the best value in my opinion four full-size thing two travel size items and then two sample items getting a really good value for how much you're paying for like I said this was $48 after tax it was like 51 let's open it up so this is what the actual gift set looks so this is what the actual gift set looks like i'm gonna start off with the thing i'm most excited about which is the mark jacobs mascara this is the mark jacobs beauty velvet noir major volume mascara you can see it kind of looks like the Too faced um better than sex mascara and i've heard really good things about this mascara so this retails for 27 dollars. you get a full-size mascara so already off the bat of this 48 dollars gift set you're getting a 27 dollars mascara the next product in the gift set is something else that i'm really excited for this Smashbox primer. I have tried a few Smashbox primers before and I have tried the photo finish one. I really liked it. This is just a little trial size one. It's got this beautiful metallic packaging. This is a really good primer. It's kind of like that like silicone-y feel. If you try this, you know the consistency I'm talking about. This travel size one retails for $50 at Ulta Beauty. I guess we'll talk about the NARS blush next. This is the NARS blush in the shade Orgasm. I've actually never tried this before, which is crazy because it's such a popular blush because it is a beautiful color for someone who's been doing makeup since they were 12 and is currently 20 so eight years and i've never tried this blush seems really crazy to me this blush does retail for 30 dollars. the next thing that i have is the urban decay all-nighter makeup setting spray this is just like the little tiny size let me know if you guys use setting spray i actually have this one in my collection and i also have I have these two in my collection. Actually, wait, I think I think they're they're all the all-nighter. This is the original one, which is actually this, so these two are the same. And then this is the all-nighter pollution protection one. I really like this one. I'm actually really glad they included this in the kit because if you did want to take one on travel or if you just wanted to have a little one in your bag, this is literally the perfect size. It takes up no room in your purse. The next product, which is a product I've never tried before and I never thought I'd try. Right, this is the Too Faced. Peach Perfect Mattifying Loose Setting Powder. I've just always stuck with my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder, and I really like that. Look at this little peach top on the... Look at that. It's such a cute package. I'll let you guys know how I feel about this. Let me know if you've tried this powder. Next, I have three more products. The first one being Kat Von D, but I guess it's not Kat Von D. It's KVD Vegan Beauty Tattoo Liner. I have tried this eyeliner before, and I love the tip on it. Physicians Formula also makes the exact same like tip like eyeliner. It's kind of like I don't know how to describe it like a wet paintbrush That's the best way I can describe this. Actually, I think the reason I never bought it is because I always get like eyeliners in PR packages And I'm not really a big stickler on eyeliner I'll basically try whatever I want and I just pretty much like everything So the last two products they have are these two. I'm gonna go ahead and talk about the Anastasia Brow Wiz. They do always do a gift set with the Anastasia Brow Wiz and I feel kind of bad because they always put the medium brown shade and you know what a lot of people are not medium brown it is kind of tricky when you're going to put like a concealer or brow product foundation type product in one of these sets because you obviously can't appease to everyone Benefit Cosmetics does gift sets for each individual brow color I loved this brow pencil for a really long time and then stopped using it because I really just like the Benefit one more. I was never able to find a right undertone color in the Anastasia one. And the last product that I have in here, I do have these lipsticks. I don't have this shade. These are the Huda Beauty Matte Lipsticks. This one being my favorite. This is Dirty 30. Like a really pretty 
mauve. I can't remember if I've tried this shade before and maybe I just gave it to a friend because I definitely remember the shade name First Kiss. Look how pretty that is. So yeah, it definitely pulls a little bit red. Very excited about that because I love red lipstick but not like cherry red lipstick, you know? I like more like muted reds and this is more of a muted red. This Overall, if I was gonna rate this gift set, I would give it a nine out of 10. I think this is a very well-rounded gift set. It has a little bit of everything. You've got a primer, a powder, some brow products, some eye products. So overall, I would definitely recommend getting this gift set. Let me know if you guys are gonna pick this up or if you're gonna ask for it for Christmas or Hanukkah or whatever you celebrate, let a girl know. So let me know what kind of gift sets you guys want me to talk about, specific brands, specific products and stuff like that. And I will definitely check those out for you. So thank you guys so much for watching my overall review of this beauty box and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.